Hello everyone, welcome back to Pavli. So in this video we are going to understand how to send and get WhatsApp message for new LinkedIn leads via Wati. So I'm using LinkedIn lead ads to generate new leads for my business and here in this case I want whenever I receive a new lead in my LinkedIn lead ad, then automatically a confirmation message should be sent to my lead using Wati and after that automatically I should receive a new lead alert message on my WhatsApp using Wati. So I had to build this connection, I need to connect these applications using an automatic software named as Pavli Connect. So to learn this process step by step, let me take you to my screen. Welcome to my screen. So in this video, we are going to understand how to send and get WhatsApp message for new LinkedIn leads via Wati. So as I've already mentioned in my introduction that I use LinkedIn lead ads to find new leads for my business. But here reaching out to each lead individually can be time consuming. So here in this case, I want whenever I receive a new lead through my LinkedIn lead ad form, then automatically a confirmation WhatsApp message should be sent to my lead using Wati. And after that, automatically I should receive a new lead alert WhatsApp message with all the lead details using Wati so that I don't miss any lead. So by using Wati to send and receive WhatsApp messages automatically, I can streamline my communication process. For example, whenever a new lead signs up through LinkedIn, Wati can instantly send them a personalized welcome message on WhatsApp and capture their replies. This way, I can connect with new leads quickly, make a good first impression and keep track of all our conversations in one place, making my follow-ups more efficient and organized. So here to build this connection, I need to connect my LinkedIn Legion form with my Wati account and here to build this connection, I'm going to use an automation software named as Pabli Connect. So Pabli Connect is an amazing automation and integration software and it connects all your favorite apps and makes them work together seamlessly. You can set it up to do things automatically like updating customer info across platforms or sending notifications when something important happens. It's really easy to use and saves you tons of time that you can spend on more important stuff. Plus it keeps everything organized and error free so you can focus on growing your business hustle free. So this is the homepage of Pabli Connect and you can visit it by simply browsing for the URL pabli.com slash connect. Here you can see two options that are sign in and sign up free. If you're a new user, click on sign up free and get 300 tasks every month to explore the software. And if you're an existing user, click on sign in. Here I'm an existing user, so I'm clicking on sign in. Now after signing in, here you can see all Pabli apps window where you can see all the applications of Pabli. Here to integrate my applications, I'm going to use Pabli Connect. Now this is the dashboard of Pabli Connect and here to build my connection, I need to create a workflow first. So for that, I'm going to click on this create workflow button given on the top right corner. Now here in this create workflow dialog box, I have to give a name to my workflow. So here I'm going to give the name as send and get WhatsApp message for new LinkedIn leads via Wati. And here I'm going to select my folder as automations. You can select your folder as per your need and also you can create multiple folders to save your workflows accordingly. And now here to learn how to create a new folder in Pabli Connect, you have to click on this learn more link given over here. And by clicking on this, it will take you to a forum window where you can see all the instructions to how to create a new folder in Pabli Connect. So now moving back to my Pabli's dashboard and here to create a new workflow, I'm going to click on this create button given over here. Now here in this workflow window, you can see we have successfully created a workflow and here on my screen you can see the two most important principles of an automation process that are trigger and action. Where trigger says when this happens and action says do this. That means action is a response towards a trigger. Your automation can have a single trigger but multiple action steps. Now let's begin with our automation by simply setting up a trigger. So here I'm going to select my trigger application as LinkedIn Legion Forms. So LinkedIn Legion Form is a tool that allows businesses to collect leads directly from LinkedIn through targeted ads. When someone clicks on your ad, their information is automatically filled in from their LinkedIn profile making it easy for them to submit their details. People use LinkedIn lead ads because it simplifies the process of capturing high quality leads, especially from professionals and decision makers. And it's an effective way to reach and engage the right audience for your business without making them fill out the long forms. 
So here in my LinkedIn lead gen forms trigger, I'm going to select my trigger event as new lead gen form response. So that whenever a new lead is going to be captured in my LinkedIn lead gen form, then automatically Public Connect is going to capture the response. Or you can say that whenever we are going to receive a new lead in our LinkedIn lead gen form, then automatically this entire workflow is going to be triggered. And now here to connect my LinkedIn lead gen forms with Public Connect, here I'm going to click on this connect. Here to build a new connection, I'm going to select add new connection. If your LinkedIn Legion Forms account is already connected with Public Connect, then you can click on select existing connection. And now here to build a new connection, I'm going to click on this connect with LinkedIn Legion Forms. And here you can see it has automatically taken my email and the password of my LinkedIn account. So now here I'm going to click on this sign in from over here. And authorization successful. So here you can see we easily got connected because here I was already logged in in my LinkedIn Legion account. So to build an easy connection, make sure you're already logged in your LinkedIn Legion account. So moving back to my Pabli's workflow and now here after building a successful connection, moving forward and then here it is asking me to select my account. So in this drop down menu, you can see my account's name which I have already created. So here I'm going to select my specific account name which I'm going to use in this entire automation that is Naveen Kohli. And now here after selecting my account name, here it is asking me to select my lead form. So here to select this lead form, I'm going to click on this drop down menu from here and from here I'm going to select my lead form form as sample legion form and now here after selecting my account and my lead form i'm going to click on the save and send test request but here before clicking on the save and send test request we are going to generate a test lead in our linkedin legion form so for that let me take you back to my linkedin legion form account and here in my linkedin lead form account under ads you can see all the ad campaigns which i've created for my use and also here you can see that my ad campaigns are in a draft mode so here I'm going to use this particular ad form and now here I'm going to open this ad campaign. And now here I'm going to generate a test lead by simply filling out a form which is present in this ad. So for that I'm going to click on this apply now button given over here. And here you can see it is asking me to enter the email address and the phone number. And also over here you can see that the first name, last name and the company name is already filled in. So here you can see the first name, last name and company name are some static fields because here I'm generating a test lead in my draft campaign. So here if you're running a live campaign then your lead will receive an option to enter the first name, last name and the company name also. So here I'm going to enter a random email address and a phone number to generate a test lead. So let's suppose here for the email address I'm going to enter my email address as demo at the rate pabletoots.com and here I'm going to enter some random phone number and now here after entering both the required data I'm going to click on the submit given over here. And here you can see it says information sent to Pabli. That means we have successfully submitted a lead gen form over here. So now let's go back to our Pabli's workflow. And now here after generating a test lead, we are going to click on the save and send test request given over here. And here you can see we have received a successful response where we have received a test response or you can say we have received a sample response over here. So here you can see in the response we have received the email that we entered that was demo at the rate pabletoots.com scrolling little down. Here you can see the phone number that we entered by filling out a form scrolling little down. And here for the first name we have received the value as first name only. And here for the last name we have received the value as last name only scrolling little down. And here you can see the company name we have received as company name and the magnet brains. So you can see we have received a test response over here. That means here we have successfully generated a test lead. So with this we have successfully set up our trigger step over here. But here let me tell you that LinkedIn Legion form is a pooling based application. That means it will look for the new responses in every 10 minutes. So here if you want to set this trigger time then you have to click on this three dots given over here and from here you have to select set trigger time. And then a dialog box will appear in front of you and from here you can see we have received the option for triggers time. So from here you have to click on this drop down menu and here you can see the minimum trigger time we can select is check every 10 minutes and maximum is 24 hours. So here I have already selected the minimum time so moving back and with this we have successfully set up our trigger. Now let's move to action step and here I am going to select my action application as Bharti. 
So Wati is a tool that helps businesses manage customer interactions via WhatsApp. It makes it easy to send and receive messages, set up automated replies and handle customer support through WhatsApp's popular messaging app. People use Wati because it streamlines communication with customers, allowing businesses to provide quick and personalized service, manage inquiries efficiently and engage with their audience effectively. It's specially useful for companies looking to leverage WhatsApp for customer service and marketing in a simple organized way. So here in my Wati's action step, I'm going to select my action event as send template message so that whenever we are going to receive a new lead in our LinkedIn lead gen form, then automatically a confirmation or a welcome message should be sent to our lead through Wati. And now here to connect my Wati account with Pabli Connect, here I'm going to click on this connect. Here to build a new connection, I'm going to select add new connection. If your Vati account is already connected with Pabli Connect, then you can click on select existing connection. And now here to build a new connection, it is asking me for an API endpoint and the access token. So here following the instructions given below, here I've already logged in my Vati account. And from here, I'm going to click on this API docs option given over here. And from here, you can see I have received the access token and the API endpoint. So here I'm going to copy both of the details and paste in my Pabli's workflow. And now here after entering both the required data, I'm going to click on the save given over here. And here you can see we are now successfully connected. So moving forward and then here it is asking me to enter the WhatsApp number. That means here I need to enter the number to whom I want to send this WhatsApp message. So basically here it means that I need to enter my leads phone number to whom I want to send this WhatsApp message. So here instead of entering my leads phone number manually, here I'm going to map the data. Mapping data means insert data from previous step. That means here I'm going to map the data from the response I have received in my trigger step. Mapping makes our text dynamic so that whenever we are going to receive the new lead in our LinkedIn lead gen form, then automatically this previously existing detail will be updated with the new one. So here I'm going to map my leads phone number. So this is my leads phone number moving forward and then here it is asking me to select my template. So here in this drop down option you can see all the templates which I have created for my use till now. So here to select this particular template let me take you to my Wati account. And here under templates you can see all the templates which I have created for my use. So here I am going to use my template which I have created with the name LinkedIn Leads New. So here let me show you this particular template. And here you can see the template which I have created which says hi name. Thank you for connecting with us on LinkedIn. We are excited to help you. If you have any questions or need more information, feel free to reply here and we will get back to you quickly. Looking forward to assisting you. Best regards, ABC Company. So here you can see I have used a variable in the place of name. That is because here I want whenever I receive a new lead in my LinkedIn lead gen form, then automatically this previously existing lead name should be updated with the new one. Variables makes our text dynamic and you can add multiple variables in your draft. So this was the message template which I'm going to use and now let's move back to our Pabli's workflow and here I'm going to select my template as LinkedIn Leads New. And now here after selecting this template name, here it is asking me to enter the broadcast name. So here I'm going to enter my broadcast name as New Lead. So this is my broadcast name and here you can add this broadcast name as per your need. And then here it is asking me to enter the custom params. So here to enter this custom params, we have received a particular format in this help text given below which says provide the params in comma separated object which will be used in the template message. That means here in this field we need to enter the key and the value of the variable that we have used in our template. So as you have already seen that I have used a single variable in my template. So here I am going to copy this format over here. And then I'm going to paste it over here. And then here in front of the key name, I'm going to enter my variable name. That was name only. And then here I'm going to enter the value of the name. So that means here I'm going to map the value of my variable. That means here I need to map my lead's name. So for that I'm going to map my lead's first name. So this is my lead's first name. Moving forward. And now here after entering all the required data, I'm going to click on the save and send test request. But here before clicking on the save and send test request, I'm going to replace this dummy user number with my original number so that I can receive a WhatsApp message. So here I've entered my own WhatsApp number and now I'm going to click on the save and send test request given over here. And here you can see we have received a successful response. That means we have successfully sent a WhatsApp message on my own phone number. So now let's go and check my WhatsApp. And here you can see we have successfully received a message over here which says hi first name. 
Thank you for connecting with us on LinkedIn. We are excited to help you. If you have any questions or need more information, feel free to reply here and we will get back to you quickly. Looking forward to assisting you. Best regards, ABC Company. So here you can see we have successfully replaced the variable with our lead's first name. And with this, we have successfully set up this action step as well. Now let's move to another action step by clicking on this add action step button given over here. And here in this action step, again here I'm going to select my action application as Vati only. Because this time I'm going to send a new lead alert WhatsApp message to myself on my WhatsApp number using Vati. So again here in this action step, I'm going to select my action event as send template message. So here by selecting this action event, I'm going to use different template message to receive a new lead alert on my WhatsApp number. So now whenever we are going to receive a new lead through our LinkedIn Legion form, then automatically a welcome message will be sent to our lead through RT. And after that, automatically we are going to receive a new lead alert message on our WhatsApp using RT. And now here to connect my RT with Pabli Connect, here I'm going to click on this connect. And here to build this connection, I'm going to click on this select existing connection because I've already connected my Vati account with Pabli Connect in my previous action step. And now here after selecting my existing connection, I'm going to click on the save given over here. And here you can see we are now successfully connected. So moving forward and then here it is asking me for a WhatsApp number. So again here I need to enter the number to whom I want to send this particular WhatsApp message. So as I've already told you that I want to send this particular WhatsApp message to myself. So here I'm going to enter my own WhatsApp number. So this is my WhatsApp number and then here it is asking me to select the template. So here to get the message template for this particular action step, let me take you back to my Vati account. And here you can see all the templates which I have created and now I'm going to use a template which is named as get LinkedIn leads. So now let me show you this template. And here you can see the template which I have drafted which says new LinkedIn lead alert. You have got a new lead from LinkedIn. Name, email and company. Take a moment to review their details and follow up promptly to make the most of this opportunity. So here you can see I have used three variables in this particular template that is name, email and company. So now here in my Pabli's workflow, I'm going to map the values for this particular three variables. So for now, let me take you back to my Pabli's workflow. And here I'm going to select my template as get LinkedIn leads. And now here after selecting my template here it is asking me to enter my broadcast name so again here i'm going to enter my broadcast name as new leads and now here after entering my broadcast name here it is asking me to enter the custom params so here i've already shown you that i have used three variables in my current template so here i'm going to map the values for my three variables so firstly here i'm going to copy this format and then i'm going to paste it over here and then here for the name of the variable i'm going to enter the name as name and then here i'm going to map the value for the name so this is the first name of my lead space and then the last name. And now here I'm going to enter the second variable by placing the comma first and then I'm going to paste that format again. And then here for the name I'm going to enter the name as email and then here I'm going to map the email of my lead so that I'm going to search for the email. And here you can see we have received the email of our lead. So here I'm going to map it. And lastly here I'm going to enter my lead's company name. So for that I'm going to paste the format again. And here for the name I'm going to enter the name as company. And here I'm going to map the value for the company. So here I'm going to search for the company name. So here you can see the company name. And now here after entering all the required data, I'm going to click on the save and send test request given over here. And here you can see we have received a successful response. That means we have successfully sent a new WhatsApp message on our WhatsApp number. So now let's go and check it. And here you can see we have received a new WhatsApp message over here which says new LinkedIn lead alert. You have got a new lead from LinkedIn name, first name, last name, email as demo at the rate pablitudes.com and company as Magnet Brains. Take a moment to review their details and follow up promptly to make the most of this opportunity. So now with this, we have successfully set up this entire automation. Now let me summarize this whole video for you. So here we have taken our trigger as LinkedIn Legion forms and our action as Vati. So that whenever we are going to receive a new lead through our LinkedIn Legion form, then automatically a welcome message will be sent to our lead through Vati. And after that, automatically we are going to receive a new lead alert message on our WhatsApp through Vati. Now if you want to use the same workflow, then you can find the clue link in the description box below. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Not only these applications, you can integrate many other applications with Pabli Connect. If you have any doubt, you can contact us on support at zaritpabli.com. If you have any query, you can contact us on forum.pabli.com. And if you have any pricing related issue, then you can contact us on www.pabli.com. If you like the video, please subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends.